hello friends in this section we will learn about graphs then what is graphs graph is one of the non-linear data structures and graph is used in many areas like networking geographical information systems global position systems for finding the route between the source and destinations so in details we see the graph a graph g consists of two sets v and e v means is a finite not empty set of vertices and e is a set of edges in diagram here g is a graph and here use v for set of vertices and e for set of edges here diagrams a b d e f and c is the vertices v1 v2 v3 v4 v5 and v6 and is connected by the edges that is e1 e2 e3 e4 e5 e6 and e7 this is a graph this is a collection of vertices and edges so we see the next points that is directed graph is the type of one of the type of graph so what is directed graph a graph in which each edge is represented by a directed graph for example a to b where is the tail is a and b is the head of the edge and b to a is another edge so this is a directed graph which has a particular directions that is a to b okay or b to c or a to c there is three directions so here v is equal to a b c there are three vertices a b c and directed graph a b a b b c then b c and a c a c this is a directed graph so this is a directed graph which has the in which the direction is is direction is there so next graph is undirected graphs a graph in which pair of vertices representing any edge is an order that is 1 to 2 or 2 1 represent the same edge there is a no directions there is a both direction that is 1 2 2 or 2 1 so here vertices 1 2 3 4 and edges 1 comma 2 is the edge then 2 comma 1 is the another edge the same edge is represented by both 1 comma 2 or 2 comma 1 that is an order that is there is a no directions so it is called as undirected graph so next is a uh, adjacent vertices so vertex v1 is said to be adjacent to v2 if there is an edge v1 comma v2 or v2 comma v1 in diagram node 2 has two adjacent vertices that is 1 or 3 1 or 3 this is called as adjacent vertices if there is a edge between the two vertices so next point is path and what is path a path is a sequence of vertices is called as path in above diagrams 1 3 and 4 is the path between 1 or 4 this is path that is a sequence of vertices so next point is a cycle a cycle is a path in which first or last vertices are the same in above diagrams 1 1 2 3 1 is the cycle is called as cycle so next point is connected graph a graph is called as connected if there is exist path from only vertex to any other vertex is called as connected graph the diagram shows the connected graph there is a every edge is connected to any other vertex sorry every vertex is connected to any other vertex is called as connected graph so next point is a degree the number of edges on a vertex determine its degree 
in above diagrams the degree of vertex 2 is 3 because there is number of edges is 3 1 2 and 3 so degree of vertex 2 is 3 this is the degree so next point is complete graph a graph is said to be a complete or fully connected if there is a path from every vertex to every other vertex so there are in diagrams there each vertex is connected to every other vertex so that graph is called as complete graph the next point is weighted graph a graph is said to be weighted graph if there if every edge in the graph is assigned some weight or value the weight of the edge is a value that represent distance between two vertices so it's called as weighted graph in which two vertices are connected by the edge and edge has the value which represent the distance between two vertices is called as weighted graph thank you and subscribe our channel logic computer institute for more videos